If you want to make $1 million with Terra Luna this year, you have to watch this video. Terra Luna's growth has been absolutely insane over the past month with it getting over 100% in gains at its peak just a couple days ago. And I know what you guys might be thinking, hey Zach, if it just got 100% in gains, isn't it just going to go down in value? And my reply to that would be, possibly. However, this video is going to be looking at a long-term outlook for Luna and I will be giving my price predictions where I think Terra Luna is going to be by the end of 2022. I will also be sharing with you guys how you can use Terra Luna and its ecosystem to make even more money than just investing in it. I'll first explain the Terra Luna ecosystem as a whole and then I will be sharing with you guys how you can make money by investing in it, staking in it, and utilizing its stable coin. Make sure that you guys leave a like and subscribe and watch all the way until the end of the video so you don't miss out on how to make a million dollars with Terra Luna this year. So what is Terra Luna you may ask? Terra is a public blockchain deploying a suite of decentralized stablecoins which underpin a thriving ecosystem that brings DeFi to the masses. Terra was created by co-founders Daniel Shin and Do Kwon in 2018 with the goal of maximizing the potential of blockchain technology to make a fully decentralized payment system. It is basically a proof of stake blockchain that provides its holders with staking rewards and governance power. Terra is basically trying to be the ultimate way to transact with with cryptocurrencies in the future. This is why they have built out their stable coins to be able to track the price of fiat currencies. Their stable coin is going to be UST or Terra USD and is currently the 14th largest cryptocurrency by market cap. So not only do they have the seventh biggest cryptocurrency by market cap Luna right now, but they also have the 14th biggest one with UST. Stable coins are going to be one of the main features of Terra. They can basically be used like a fiat currency, but with the added benefits of having a blockchain. The benefits that come along with having this blockchain are going to be an unchangeable public ledger, instant transactions, fast settlement times, and fewer fees. So basically it's just like the US dollar, but then it's backed by a blockchain. So now you might be thinking, what makes Terra Luna unique? A huge part of what makes Terra Luna unique is their use of stable coins. There is some controversy around other stable coins such as Tether because there's no way of knowing that these other stable coins are pegged one-to-one -to, -one to the US dollar. Even though that's exactly what a stable coin is supposed to be, a crypto that is backed one-to-one -to, -one to the US dollar, there is no way of knowing for sure that it is actually pegged one-to-one. -one. However, that is not the case with Terra's stablecoin UST. UST is pegged with Senurage, which is basically the process of burning Luna to mint Terra. This means that Terra's stablecoin UST can operate on its own and every transaction is able to be seen on the public blockchain, so people can see whether Terra is actually pegged to the US dollar one-for-one, -one, which it is. So this system that they have created allows for a stable coin to be fully decentralized and scalable for the future. Now you might be thinking, what are the advantages that Terra Luna has over its competitors? I don't want to be beating a dead horse here, but their stable coin is a massive advantage over their competitors. Like I said before, this allows for Terra to be fully automated and scalable, so no one person has to do anything for this crypto to thrive. Terra is truly scalable, which is something that a lot of different cryptocurrencies come into trouble with. Take Ethereum for example. They started out in the proof of work model, which worked for a while until they really got to scale and then people realized hey these gas fees are astronomical almost like gas fees in america today I am so mad that I put that winky face into the script. Sorry, let's just move on from that. Ethereum realized that this is a problem and now they're moving to the proof of stake model, but Terra has already been in the proof of stake model for so long. This gives them an advantage over Ethereum and other competitors. Another advantage that Terra has is that their holders can stake their tokens and earn consistent rewards from their stable coin transaction fees. We're gonna be discussing staking a little bit further in this video, but it is something that you'll start to see every cryptocurrency start to do as they move to the proof of stake protocol. The last advantage that we're going to be going over today is that Luna is deflationary in nature. So when Luna is swapped for UST, a percentage of Luna is burned. This means that the supply goes down and the price of your coins go up. The final thing that we're going to be going over before you learn how to make a million dollars with Luna is going to be the dApps. So the term dApp refers to decentralized app and Terra Luna currently has a vast ecosystem of these dApps. A very important dApp that you should be looking into if you're a Terra Luna holder is going to be Station. This is where you can create a wallet and stake your Luna for rewards. Just a piece of advice, if you guys have any Terra Luna on an exchange, I would definitely move it into the Station wallet so you can get the most out of your Terra Luna coins. A few dApps that are built off the Terra blockchain are going to be Chai, Anchor Protocol, and Terra NFT. Chai is going to be a mobile payment app that is powered by Terra's blockchain that is being widely adopted in South Korea and has more than 2 million users to date. Anchor Protocol is going to be a savings 
savings account with high yields powered by staking rewards from multiple proof of stake blockchain. There is currently about 10 billion Terra USD or UST locked and this savings account has no minimum deposit requirements and can be used by anyone in the world with an internet connection. The final dab that we're going to be going over is going to be Terra NFT which is how you can buy NFTs on the Terra blockchain. NFTs aren't exactly huge on Terra's blockchain yet but they could be getting there soon. And really quick guys before we get into how you can make a million dollars off of Terra Luna if you guys are interested in getting some free money then go ahead and get signed up to public with the first link in the description. Public.com is a social investing network that allows you to see what your favorite investors are buying and selling in the stock and crypto markets. Plus when you use our link and deposit one dollar you get the chance to earn a stock worth up to three hundred dollars. So go ahead and click that first link in the description and get signed up to public.com today. Okay so there are a ton of ways that you guys can make money off of the Terra Luna ecosystem but we're going to be going over three main ones in this video. You can earn money by simply holding Luna token, you can hold money by staking Luna token, and you can also earn money by using Anchor Protocol to get stable yields. Okay so the first way that you can make money is obviously by holding the token. It's no secret that Terra Luna has been absolutely killing it as of late going from $50 at the beginning of the month to $100 by the end of the month. We are currently sitting at about $89 as we speak and I do not see this puppy stopping whatsoever. By the end of the year I could easily see Luna get to $200 to $250 with the right crypto bull run. That's anywhere from a 3 to 4x. So the first way to make money is just by holding Luna token. The second way to make money is by simply staking your Luna token. There are multiple ways that you guys can start staking your Terra Luna today but the two main ones are going to be with Terra Luna's wallet as well as on exchanges. Using Terra's wallet station you can stake your Luna and get up to a 7% return every year. Now this isn't a very good return for staking but it's definitely better than nothing. The better way in my opinion is going to be staking Luna on either crypto.com slash earn or Binance. Now on crypto.com slash earn you can stake your Luna and get up to a 3% return which obviously isn't very good but on Binance you can get up to an 18% return for staking your Luna for up to 90 days. So Binance is probably going to be your best bet for staking as they give the best rewards or the best APY. The last way that you guys can make money from the Terra ecosystem is going to be utilizing the Anchor Protocol to get stable yields from UST. As of right now, you can deposit your UST stablecoin on Anchor Protocol and get up to a 20% APY. A 20% APY is pretty unheard of for a stablecoin and 20% can really compound, especially if you're doing it for years upon years upon years. When you use all these methods to start making money with the Terra ecosystem, it really starts to add up and when you pair that with the crypto bull run that I believe is coming this year sometime soon, you could definitely make a ton of money with this coin this year. And there you guys have it, that is going to be the Terra Luna ecosystem summed up in 10 minutes or less. Guys, this really has become one of my favorite coins to invest in over the past couple of months and I really do see a bright future for it, so make sure that you guys are using all parts of the ecosystem so that you don't miss out on any gains. Make sure you guys get your free stock with the first link in the description and also get signed up to our private discord with that second link in the description. But other than that guys, that's going to be it for me today. I'm Zach with Finance Bro. Take it easy.